Welcome everyone to Battlefield 5. I have not done a video like this in a while. And uh, just kind of wanted to get this out. It's been, I recorded this almost a month ago and I've been wanting to get this out. So here we go. We'll play, um, what are we? We're Assault. We have an STG. And we're playing a game mode of Conquest. Where you have to secure the flags and hold them as long as possible while you take out the enemy and eliminate their tickets. So I'm just doing a voiceover here. I did not record any uh, audio while I played. I typically don't do that with FPS games. I get too distracted while playing, so I don't do that. So right now we have A and B, so C is the objective. And this is C right here around the corner. Kind of a hard one to get because it's in the open. Not a lot of cover. I saw a guy to the left there. I think he tries to get me. Oh, he does get me. But I destroyed the transport. <laughs> that was my goal. Typically in this game too, you want to wait for your uh, medics to come and revive you. But a lot of times I just respawn. Sometimes it takes them forever to get to you or they're around you, but nobody, nobody revives you. Like the medics don't, sometimes people don't play the, uh, with the medic class, right? I had no idea that guy was there. I mean, I would prefer to live stream this kind of stuff rather than make videos. That's why I don't come out with a lot of FPS videos very often. Um, but I don't live stream right now either. I don't have... I, I have the ability to do it. I just don't have it all set up. And I haven't done enough research to do that. I don't like to go into things like that blindly. So we're just throwing a video out here today. As you see, I just saw those guys uh, drive by. One guy did jump out. That's who I'm going to try and take out right now. They were going for A, and I really don't want them to get A, because then they'll trap us. So if they have A and then they have um, C and D, they can squeeze us in the middle and take us out pretty easily. So I'm just checking to see if there's anybody else. Obviously, there was somebody driving the vehicle, and somebody jumped out. I'm not sure if the driver jumped out or if there was, you know, multiple people in that vehicle. So that's all I'm looking for here. See if they're hiding and uh, waiting to pounce on A. I didn't see anybody, so we're moving up to C again. And the STG is not a long-range weapon more medium range like that any longer than that I probably would have had a difficult time taking that guy out pay attention here oh nice shot Picking their heads up. <laughs> Not always a good idea in Battlefield. And in this game, because you can spawn on your squad mates, uh, you're never, there's no, there's a, a spawn point, but. Uh, it's better just to spawn your squad mates. Because of that, you don't know where everybody's coming from. So you have to have your head on a on a swivel, basically. And it's pretty much a good um, type of game where it's not somebody's not going to camp the spawn points. You, know, you can't really do that in this game. It's, uh, I hardly ever see that anyway. 
and you really can't camp in this game anyway because somebody's eventually going to see where you're shooting from and they're going to come and get you. A lot of times when I get killed by somebody who's camping, I go, um, if, if, I, yeah, if they kill me, then I respawn and go back after them because I know where they're sitting. Normally when I go back to them, they're either not there or somebody else already took them out. Shotguns in this game are crazy. They're so overpowered. I typically pay, oh, excuse me, I typically play Battlefield 1. I prefer that uh, over any other Battlefield, but that's kind of, that game's kind of getting old, and although there's still servers available, on the PlayStation, I don't find too many very often. So I ended up jumping on this one because this one's still very popular. I think it's more popular than 2042. There is an enemy presence at objective dog. Mobilizing on the objective. And that game just... 2042, it's a good game. It is now. When it first came out, it was, it was pretty bad. I don't know what they were thinking when they released it. Throw a grenade. Someone's usually hiding behind that wall. Alright, looks like they got him. We're, we're recovering D. No clue where that guy was. <laughs> I just got help from a, from a teammate. Otherwise I was dead. Trying to capture C. Trying to find a good way to get in there. This is a very difficult uh, flight to capture. On this map. I hear the guy. I don't know how I missed him. Close range shotgun, there's no way I was going to win that unless I had better aim, which I didn't this time. So I respawned on my squad mate. So right now I'm the squad leader, so I have the ability to call in airstrikes and other things. I think I do do that eventually. But if you see, you see my my name right there, and then right next to it, I can hold L1 and R1 and set up call in an airstrike or an airdrop or something like that. Depends on how many points we have. We currently have 51, 67, so you have to have a certain amount of points to call in certain things. But I'm pretty sure I show that at some point.
I don't know how that didn't kill him. I have no clue. That's probably the one thing about Battlefield is the uh, time to kill. It's, it's off. It's always off. There's no way you should have survived that. I don't think either of us could see us. Could see. <laughs> None of us could see. We were just blindly shooting. Oh, bad shooting. I do that a lot. <laughs> Actually, this game I didn't do too bad, but right there was not a very good shot. Aiming was awful. That's the thing with controllers, too, with the analog sticks. They're very sensitive. Even though I try to adjust that stuff, I still can never get it to the point where, you know, my aiming isn't as bad as it seems to be. Another cool thing about Battlefield is the destruction uh, in on the maps. A lot of things you can just destroy, buildings and all that stuff. So people can't, that's what I'm saying, people can't camp all the time. Because you can just take the buildings down and it will kill them. The uh, debris falling and all that will kill them. took him out saw where he was shooting from even through the uh, smoke didn't have too much of a problem locating I have a hard time getting kill streaks in battlefield so but I ended up getting him on this map Took Baker. I'm trying to go out, I'm trying to go and help them here at B. Let's see if we can get that back. Hiding in the bush. I think not. <laughs> I love FPS games. I, I do. They can be frustrating at times, but they're so much fun. Oh. I have no idea how I missed that guy lying down. Plus there was just too many. Three against one. I'd be lucky to win that. I ain't that good. That's the type of guy that I go back and get revenge on, which I ended up doing. Actually, this next part of this, I think is probably the best... Uh, 
the best that I've done on this map. Yeah, see, he's still there. I knew he was there. I have no idea where they're coming from. Attention, objective Charlie is no longer under our control. Ah, there we go. Not a medic, but your squad mates can revive you in Battlefield 5. I think you could do that in 2042 as well. I don't think that's a new that was a new feature in the game. It's always been part of the game. And here we go. I'm getting getting beat down pretty good. But I end up circling around. Go behind him, which is what you should do. He didn't see me yet. Ran right into him. Coming around. Got the shotgun. Rear. Can't help him up. <laughs> I just went on a shooting rampage here. Trying to protect this this flag. I was the only one for what for what like a minute? Then everyone else started to come back in. So that yeah, was pretty good. Doing it by myself. Don't typically have that opportunity. No idea how I killed him. I shouldn't have. I should have died. There you go. <laughs> One of the medic. Yeah, the medic will help me. So now we have 17,600 points down there, so I can use. I can call something in. I think I do here in a few minutes. I, think I'm, I try to get, I don't know how many points it is, I don't remember, but airstrikes are like 17,000 I think, 17,000 some points. So that's what an airstrike looks like. I didn't call that one in, but that's what it looks like. And you can die by your own airstrike, too. Definitely. So you got to be careful not to run into them. Objective Abel has been lost. There we go. 17,750. That's what it was. Requesting an artillery barrage on this location. So I did an artillery strike on D... Hoping it clears that out. At least gives us an opportunity to take it. Oh, there you go. So you don't, <laughs> don't ever run into your own artillery strike. Somebody shooting at me, I can definitely hear it. I don't know where he is though. Objective Baker is no longer secure.
Objective Charlie is under our control. So they took A and B, which is back at the beginning of the map where we spawned in originally. But we still have three flags, and they only have two, and they're they're getting beat down pretty well right now. As you see, it's 259 to 79 at the top there to screen. At this point, they really don't stand a chance. Whoops. The battle is nearly won. Ooh, nice shot. Oh, I didn't even know he was up there. <laughs> Good shot there, buddy. We have 40 guys left. 40 spawns left, I should say. There's a ton of them here, too. I don't know how he missed me. Oh. <laughs> Snuck up behind me. Stabbed me in the back. Should have had him ran out of bullets. There you are. We win 221 to 0. What did I get here at the end? I think I was 25 and 11, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 25 kills. 25 and 11, that's what it was. Well, that's it, everyone. That is a uh, match from Battlefield 5. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. And if you want to stay up to date with any future videos of mine, please hit that notification button. Thanks again for joining me, guys. This is Battlefield 5. You guys take care of yourselves. I'm Citizen Z, and I'll see you in the next one.